All right, three to one, let's go. Okay, hello, hello, friends, back again. Um, where we left off was that we uh, wrote the mutate individual and mutate population functions, as well as before that we wrote the mate parents, create population, create individual functions, and we also defined the run genetic algo function. Now, most of it is done. All we needed to all we need to do is um, write this select best function. So this function will go through each individual in a given population and uh, score their fitness. Once we've scored the fitness of all of our population, we're going to sort the population based on that fitness, based on that fitness score, and we're going to select the top and best individuals, and we're going to return them. Bam, that's it. Boom, boom, boogie, boogie, baga. Woo! Let's do it. Easy enough. Easy enough. Easy enough and cool enough. <clears throat> So what we want to have is to have a, we want to have um, a list of fitnesses. Now we're gonna go through the whole population. I'm going to enumerate through it. Um, we're going to go through the population, keeping in mind the indices, and um, compute the fitness for each of the individuals. And we're going to append them. We're going to add them to a, to a, to the fitnesses list. Now that we have the list, we're going to sort it based on the cost based on the fitness and we're going to select the top top most uh, top most uh, individuals So this whole mumbo jumbo mumbo jumbo here basically <clears throat> takes our list, our initial list, which is a list of lists, um, and each list within that major list has two elements, and it transforms it into a data frame. And we do this because uh, with data frame we can uh, we can just um, we we can sort it very easily <clears throat> based on. Uh, by one so that's we sorted based on the column number one which is uh, this column this is column number zero and this is column number one actually this is the index column I, I believe uh, or column number zero this is column number one anyway so we, we sort it based on that one uh, descending and uh, once we sort it we will take out of there we'll take um, the end best um, excuse me it should be like this <clears throat> we'll take the end best uh, elements out of that so we'll take the the um, so we're sending it the uh, we're sorting it descendingly so we need to take the top most n elements and uh, finally so here we select the indices and here we select the parents out of the initial population which are whose indexes indices are in that index list that we've selected based on uh, based on um, them being in the top cool now um, what I'm also going to do here uh, just so that we sort of keep track of of what's going on in, in the population we're going to uh, print we're gonna print uh, our current status Our current status of best, average, and worst individuals. Uh, 
Okay, cool, 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 cool. Now that this is out of the way, um, in the next video, I'm going to uh, run the genetic algorithm. So stay tuned.